Hello and welcome everyone to this video where we explore the Alteryx user interface. So let's begin. So this is how the Alteryx designer looks like when you're working with it. To help you understand this better, I have divided this entire screen into multiple parts. First, let's see what are the main parts. The ribbon tab that you see on the top is called Tool Palette. It consists of multiple different tabs and each having multiple tools in it. Now don't be scared if you don't understand these tools icon. We will see as we proceed. So after understanding what is tool palette, let's understand what is this tool search box. Let's assume you're a beginner. You may remember certain tools name, but you don't know where it is. As you type few letters, you get a search drop down options from where you can drag and drop these icons to create your workflow. Now the question is, where do you drag and drop these icons? You do that in the canvas area. Canvas is like your working area where you drag and drop these tools and create your workflow. In this canvas area, you also find a button called run. So once your workflow is complete or you want to test this, you may press the shortcut key control R. Next. You will see that almost every tool icon will have these two green tabs on the left and the right side of it. The first one is called input anchor. The next one is called output anchor. These two icons can be found into the results window as well. Depending on which one is activated, you might get different preview of the data. Next, for each tool that you're using, you'd have a configuration panel where you can change the settings so that you can get the desired output. Next, this is the results window. Some people refer this as a preview window. Under this results panel, you also see something called data and metadata. So metadata is something that allows you to see the data type of each column or field. Next, so if I now ask you to help me understand which one is tool palette or search box or canvas or results panel? Can you help me? You can pause the video and evaluate for yourself. In next three seconds, I'll show you the solution. So these five sections can be referred by the respective names as shown on the screen. And don't forget the shortcut key for run is control R. So that was a quick video on the Alteryx user interface.